Right, well, here I am at Alexandra High. Um, just in those classrooms there is actually the home ec classroom, so it's actually a kitchen. And you've seen a blast from the past, old Hester Mayer. She used to do um, supper theatre, and she was just telling me that she's going to do the first supper theatre in well over eight years again. So I'm basically here in the plane tree quad. Uh, plane tree because of this monster here. Um, which used to make my eyes itch something chronic um, because of the, the pollen and it's already starting to do that <laughs> as I stand here um, various classrooms here uh, science rooms up there um, used to be the geography classroom here at one stage <laughs> Mr Wang still here <laughs> Ola Wang uh, used to teach geography, he probably still does teach geography because <laughs> these were all his geography classrooms. Um, and he, he's still here. Wow. I tell you, this place hasn't really changed all that much, um, but it is looking a lot better than it was um, the last time I came here about four years ago. So we'll uh, go and take a little bit of a walk down here. Right, these big quads here used to be basketball courts, but um, not anymore by the looks of it. Alex has a, a, a really good reputation for basketball. I don't know if it still does. Um, past pupils have played in the South African Olympic team for basketball. So, uh, yeah, really good following there. I've been in loads of classrooms in this place. All my entire high school career was here. Basically just going up to the top floor here. Yeah. Give you a good view of the grounds. Near the sports fields at Alex. You guys um, playing some cricket in the net, so uh, not really a lot happening. It's Friday after all. In the distance there is um, what used to be Ned Bank Plaza. I think it's got a different name now. Um, and there's a little stream that runs just um, on the other side of those trees. I might just go take a walk down there and show you that. So I used to often run up and down the hill and these stairs. Uh, give you an idea of these stairs, they're a bit mean. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I used to do first aid events down here and uh, that was uh, quite something to have to run up these damn things to get to the offices if you needed to make a phone call. This was all before the advent of cellular phones. Uh. Yeah. <laughs> Not nice. <laughs> Used to sometimes come out here and lie in the middle of the field and gaze at the clouds. I was on the weekends though. Yeah. <laughs> Not really a lot to do in this uh, sleepy hollow that they call Peter Maritzburg. It's a peacock tree. Um, a lot of boys used to come and basically hide down behind the banks here yeah, um, and smoke during lunch or whenever they could. Bunk off class. We were quite isolated down there. I wonder if the shooting range is still here. Yes, they used to teach boys how to shoot with guns. <laughs> right, well, many, many years ago, uh, 
there used to be a gate here. Well, the gate's still here, but it's kind of overgrown. Um, and there used to be a bridge that used to go down. And there. And over to the shooting range. Now, the shooting range looks like it's gone. Um, we'll, we'll go over there. There's another little bridge just down here. They used to go down to what they called the cabbage patch. And um, just a field, really. Um, not the greatest places to play cricket on, but um, the cabbage patch was also synonymous with uh, people who, if you wanted to have a Barney or a Rumble, uh, or in other words, let's take this outside, um, you just come down to the, the cabbage patch, patch to um, sort out your differences. And that's where we used to go. So we'll uh, go along, you can see. Still still up there, <laughs> still standing. <laughs> Although reading some of the signs on the wall, it looks like they've had a, a massive spate of crime here. Um, they've got a whole big um, anti-crime, anti-drug um, type thing going on. Oh, it's a bit bizarre. Looks like this land no longer belongs to uh, Alex anymore. It's all been fenced off. Really bizarre. No, that was the cabbage patch over there. Um, and I said the, uh, the shooting range seems to be demolished. I'm sure the armory is still sort of here, but it's probably not an armory anymore. Um, I'm sure they've taken the firearms away many, 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 many years ago. I can't remember if the I saw whether the shooting range was here when I was last year, about four years ago. Right, well, this is what Alex is really renowned for, basketball. Um, some of the kids are playing like a friendly game here by the looks of it. That used to be the armory. The safe door is still there. <laughs> That's about it, really. swimming pool and um, the assembly rooms and the woodwork rooms are all over there. Changing rooms in what used to be called the deep end because it's the deep end side of the swimming pool which was like a social club <laughs> for teachers and all sorts of things. So, here's Founders House, the boarding establishment. Actually that's not the boarding establishment, that's the uh, matron's quarters and the laundry are all there. Uh, that there's the boarding establishment. Had a fair few rooms in there as well. Over in that part there is um, basically the what used to be the prefect study, border master's office, and um, the superintendent's flat. Quite funny, these bollards here. <laughs> I'm laughing because I'm quite surprised to still see them. Um, they used to uh, make us do bollard PT as a form of punishment where we used to have to carry these wretched things um, around for a while. But yeah, they're a bit difficult to do that now seeing as they're concreted into the ground.